Hey, hey YDC! Welcome to another episode of RTP On, on the, the Go. Go. Yan! Okay, so Ate Tin, pinag-usapan natin last Thursday sa ating RTT ang Keep the Fire Burning. And we're sure na maraming natutunan ang YDC. Kaya ngayon, magiging interview tayo ng mga youth kung ano nga ba yung natutunan nila yes. last RTT. So, let's, let's go! go. So ayun Kuya Matt, meron na tayong one youth na i-interviewin yes. ngayon. Uh, Punang pong pangalan nyo, Ate. Uh, Kisha po. Ano yung natutunan mo last RTT table talk? Yung pinaka-main takeaway ko last RTT live is yung we should never ne neglect our personal time or devotion with the Lord. In fact, yun yung pinaka-essential na kailangan natin as a Christian. Kasi through personal time with God, mas lalalim yung relationship natin sa Kanya. Mas magde-depend tayo sa kanya and mas magde-depend yung intimacy natin with the Lord. Saira Godinez po, para sa akin po, as someone po na nagbabalak niyo po pumasok sa ministry, ang natutunan ko po is huwag niyo pong ipantakip butas yung ministry sa devotion. Huwag niyo pong gawing replacement kasi iba po talaga yung personal devotion. Rigel po, yung limang cause kung bakit po tayo at namamatay yung burning desire natin para i-praise the Lord. Disappointments, offense, complacency, and materialism and especially yung in business yun po yeah. talaga yung tumatak sa akin magkakaroon po ng maraming assignments yeah. projects pero kahit na ganun po dapat maglan pa po rin tayo ng time kay Lord kung paano po tayo mag-excel sa pag-aaral pero mas mataas yung pag sa pag-praise kay Lord Amen. Praise God po patuloy ako binabago ni Lord Personally po ano yung pinaka tumatak talaga sa akin is to maintain the fire to have a firm foundation we need our our private time to the Lord And it's Amen. something that we should not neglect, neglect. Diba? our private mm -mm. fellowship with private. The Lord. Nikisha po, yung pinakatumatak po sa akin is in order po to the fire to stay burning, pinakaimportant for me is yung relationship po talaga with the Lord. Kasi yung devotion mo with the Lord, it will help in order to get closer with the Lord. Alexis po, yung sa natutunan ko po doon yung paano po kayong uminit kay Lord, magpatuloy pa po. Kung next step po kayong mas lalo po tayong magpapol, mas lalo po tayong magpapokus doon. Dapat magpatuloy lang tayo kay Lord at magpainit yung lalo. Rian, paano panitiliin yung fire sa buhay natin? Pag-devotion, especially na lagi natin yung nine si Lord. Marimind ako dun sa lagi yung nine si Lord sa Matthew 6.33. Josh po. Yung siguro po yung pinaka natutunan yung pinaka gusto kong narinig doon. For you to keep the fire burning in your heart to deny yourself. Kasi kung nabubuhay ka sa sarili mong emotion at sarili mong will, wala mangyayari sa buhay mo. So ayun, yeah, no, Kuya Matt, yeah. no, nakapag-interview na tayo. Yes. Sobrang mm. dami ko din natutunan dun sa key takeaway. Amen. Amen. Yung pinakagusto ko dun, Kuya Matt, is yung sinabi niya na dapat pagtuunan natin ng oras yung relasyon natin mm. sa Panginoon. We should not neglect our time, our personal devotion with the Lord because it is Amen. so very important for us to keep the fire burning. Amen. Ikaw naman, Kuya Matt. At sa akin talaga yung deny ourselves. Oh. Uuwi, uuwi pa rin tayo doon. Kasi mm. if we deny ourselves, we will Seek first the kingdom of God. Uh -huh. We will make Him the first priority mm -hmm. of our life. So, so that's, that's it for the another episode of RTT on, on the, the go. go. So let us be reminded that we should keep the, the fire burning. burning. See you, YDC. See you. Shalom. 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 Hey!